Yeah, let's talk about these 40-year-old women on the dating market acting like children, though. I said what I said! Like, at what age do y'all grow up? Let's take a listen to what I'm referring to. Shout out to the Pop Your Balloon and shout out to Red Pill Awareness for posting this video. Y'all just listen. How old are you? I'm 42. And what do you do? I'm a cardiac nurse and a real estate investor. Now, what are some things you look for in a woman? Uh, she just got to be cute and peaceful <laughs> and a good person. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. He got a pop when he said be cute and look good and peaceful. No breakers. Uh, bad hygiene. Okay, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> 48. Okay. And Phoenix, why did you end up popping your balloon? Because he said he wanted somebody cute. I don't really see myself as being cute. I see myself more demure, glamorous. 48. She's 48, y'all. 48. Two years away from 50. Basically a grandma. Let's continue. I popped because um, it seemed like I would like eat you up in the sense that like I'll be more dominant and like you won't. 46. And Katrina, why'd you end up popping your balloon? I popped my balloon because of the fit. I'm not really feeling the shoes um, and the pants, but love the career, love everything you said. It's just the fashion wasn't for me. I'm 40. Um, I ended up popping just because of the height situation. Y'all, you, you cannot make this up. Yeah. These women are in their 40s and still having superficial standards, superficial preferences. If you don't like this man outfit, ma'am, as his woman, help him wear his closet. Style him. Talking about how he said someone, he wants someone cute. Well, I'm demure. Spending too much damn time on TikTok. Come on, man. You don't know better than that as a cool person. Come on, man. At 48. Talking about, oh, I'll eat you up. Damn sure. Yeah, right. But, oh, I'm too masculine. I'm too masculine for you. As a female, why are you, why are you even too masculine? This blew my mind. I could not believe that woman this old acting like teenagers. Because after, once you pass, once you pass 25, you're supposed to have better expectations, better standards, best, better preferences. These 40 year old women don't even know the difference between a preference and a standard. Your deal breakers are supposed to be things like his morals, his values, his religious beliefs, you know, things that will definitely affect your life. But how the way this man dress is going to impact your life. Let me tell you why they care. Because they want to stunt. They want to bring him out. They want to post him on social media and bring him around their friends and boast and say, look at my man. Look what he's wearing. That is why she concerned herself about his fit and not the fact that this man have two great income jobs. And this man, I mean, he didn't say much about his morals and his values, but none of them didn't even take the time to say, let's ask some questions. He said he wants someone cute and this 48 year old broad is going to pop her balloon because she considered herself as demure. Y'all, I am in shock. Like 48 year old acting like this. Who is raising the children then? Who are there to help these teenage girls, these preteen girls navigate dating if the damn near 50-year-old women are all here talking about, oh, I don't like your fit? We are doomed. There's basically no one with common sense to help guide the children. This, this is it's hard to watch. It's heartbreaking to see older women act like this. They were on Kevin Samuel's show a lot. So I honestly don't know why I'm surprised. I guess it's because like, you know, you see them in a different energy. You see them in a different atmosphere. Why I'm just like, oh my God. 40 talking about height. 
at 40, you're talking, oh my gosh. As, after a certain age, you're supposed to just want companionship. Honestly, somebody who you can grow old with, somebody who you know, okay, we're going to split these bills together. We're going to do life. As long as you're not affecting my peace, as long as you're not bringing in me no unnecessary drama, I don't have to be bailing you out to jail and dealing with your baby, baby mama. Like, let's just do life. But no, homegirl over here busy about thinking about height. Y'all. Are you guys as shocked as I am? At what age do we grow up? At what age do we realize that, dang, it might be me? At what age do we start having an honest conversation about ourselves and say like, yeah, I need to do better because my, my standards and my preferences has got me this far. Maybe I need to reevaluate. Maybe I need to check myself. Another thing I want to touch on, these 48-year-old women so addicted to TikTok trying to keep up with 20-year-old, 25-year-olds. Like as a 48-year-old woman, why are you still being easily influenced by TikTok trends and TikTok phrases like demure? I bet in her 47 years, she has never heard that word once in her life until it start get popular on TikTok for some reason. And then now she's, she's coming to like, oh, I like to consider myself demure. Ma'am? Stop it. Get some help. It's little things like that. I don't know about y'all, but little things like that literally annoy me. Because it's like, grow up. Like, after a certain age, you shouldn't be so easily influenced by social media. I would say after age 30, you're supposed to make decisions on your own and not like social media tell you what adjective you should use to describe yourself. Y'all, leave your thoughts in the comments if you are as annoyed as I am. Check out this video, 38-year-old still waiting on God to send her her man like sis. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, y'all.